This DLC, Season's Greetings, is an additional episode that tells the story of the holiday season in the previous year of the main game. It took me about 5 hours to complete the game playing at a relaxed pace. It is recommended that you complete the main game first. The story delivers us daily life and drama in a moderate and cozy way like the main game. The main character is Thomas, a father of the protagonist in the main story. <laughs> Meredith! Of course. It's coming down as we speak. Wait till you see it. Since he is a father of Meredith, who is in her 40s, the story also focuses on elderly life events, such as health issues and aging. Someone pick you up and move closer to Meredith? To the big city? No, 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 no. I need space and fresh air and warmth. That's the nice thing about Florida. And it's not like your arthritis will stop acting up in weather like this. You hey, learn about there. the situations Looks of like the town and late. the feelings this of the characters that before the main story. Lemon squeezy, Mr. W. My ex-girlfriend, you mean? Yeah, she's handling it okay. I bet you woke up feeling like a million dollars after winning that monster pot last night. I'm not gonna change my cooking schedule just because of Christmas. Thomas, New interesting Thomas. characters who are not in the main story also appear. I'm just joking. The situation is not that dire. <laughs> See, this is what I'm talking about. Real conversations with real Americans, right? No one knows the town like a mailman, right, Mr. Weiss? I see you've already had the privilege of the full Connor Price experience. There is no change in the game mechanics, but you can enjoy the snow-covered scenery as you deliver the packages. The snowscape is quite beautiful. Don't miss the frozen lake, too. Several Christmas-style songs have been added to the radio. You can also listen to the familiar tunes in the main game. In my head all day. It goes, witchcraft, ooh, witchcraft, ooh. This DLC is a good opportunity to go back to the 80s in this small town in the countryside of Oregon and immerse yourself in the good old days without the internet or smartphones again. It is a great pleasure to be back in this town after two years in this way. Verdict. Highly recommended. I enjoyed it very much until the end, including the credits roll.